Monolith by Natural20 is a map for the Mayhem 2020 project, which uh, it's now June, so that was just last month. They do it every year. It's a community project. The, the gimmicks are different every year, but this year, um, I think it's just make a map with 20 sectors. Only 20 sectors. I will try Natural 20s on Ultraviolence on GL Boom Plus. This is... Oh, crap. Health looks different. There's the monolith, I suppose. So yeah, 250. Soul Sphere down there. 250, one and little zero and five. Um, I'm not sure why that first sector is marked as a secret. It almost looks like Natural Twenty is just showing off. <laughs> Look at that. Because that's what you gotta do if you're only allowed 20 sectors. You gotta join sectors whenever you can. So, that's what's going on there. Oh, that's what's good. And obviously, if you don't know how that works with Doom, for a sector to be the same, it has to have the same floor height and ceiling height. And also the texturing on the floor and ceiling are going to be the same. And the lighting is going to be the same. Um, now the walls of those sectors can look different. But the tops and bottoms are going to look the same. So that means when I'm way over here, it'll look like this on, on the floor and that on the ceiling. And it'll be this high up. A lot of monsters. What should we do? Let's jump. Let's, oh, gosh. Let's go this way, then. This, anywhere. I started with a ton of ammo, I guess. But there is an arch file somewhere. Crap. I might have to get that. Oh yeah, let's do that. I don't have the rocket launcher though. <laughs> So this is just kind of a spam of monsters map. Congratulations, you got through. Besides a couple of arch files, there's not really any reason to get too worried, though. I mean, there's so much ammo, there's a megasphere over there I can get later. There's uh, an invulnerability somewhere. Oh. And then there's him. Well, I don't know. I don't know where they keep coming from, but I guess they are one potential issue. Okay. 
Can I get back to that start area? Or not really? Still got the D running here. I don't know if uh, he went with something else for the final version. Oh. Alright then. Oh crap. These are like Um, silent teleporters. Oh. I suppose we could probably get that Megasphere now. Don't have a lot of armor, or I do have a lot of armor, but 35 health. I mean, the ammo is pretty crazy here. Why is there so much ammo? I don't get it. So I think these are all teleporters then. So we need, we need the yellow key to exit here. I guess I'll try this. Oh wow. <laughs> this is back by the beginning. Right? Yes. Okay. That doesn't do me any good. I need, uh, I need something else to explore. Try that one next. I hate that. <sighs> so obviously you can't see how many cell boxes are here, but it was more than one, which means I wasted 80 cells right there. And I had no way of knowing that. Oh, 
still coming. I had to ruin everything, didn't they? Alright, we should save it up here. Might get killed. Crap, where is the yellow door? Oh, there's the yellow door. Oh, there's the blue key. That was just bad luck right there. They just keep coming. Alright, the earth files. Oh, gosh. Did not see him there. Pretty easy to get them after someone else, which is nice. That was a lot of fire and only one of them hit him. Oh. Basically, yeah, I figured I'd be done there. Alright, so... Yeah, kind of a weird way to set up the map. I've got to go get the keys again, wherever they are. Okay, here's blue key, I think. Oh, I see. Okay, so it's just an all three door. And we just got to get red. Yeah, I mean, it's a nice little setup. 20 sectors. Monolith. It's pretty much all about a couple of big fights. But uh, the beginning starts out pretty cool with the roaming archvile and demons. <sighs> But I gotta find some more of these teleport things. The one that goes to the red key in particular. Hmm. 
don't know if there's any coding at all. I mean, there's some red lights here. Is that, is that trying to tell me anything? Try this one already. Wait, what's this? Suit <laughs> there. Ah, there we go. Oh. <laughs> now let's do that again. Not the red key, though. Well, where's the red key? Mm. All right, I'm gonna have to start marking them. There must be a teleport I'm missing somewhere. I don't, did I see the red key? I wish it would just show itself to me. I already tried that a bunch of times. I want to try the nukage one again. Not that one though. This one, yeah. Oh, that just takes me right back. This is where I got the first one. This was, yeah, this was the, I didn't even know there was a berserk there. This is where the spider started coming in. Maybe it's over here. It is over here. Okay. Perfect. All right. Well, yeah, it was fun. It had some... Nice scenery, and it was uh, very creative with just 20 sectors, I thought. I wouldn't have made a map be able to look like that with 20 sectors. Uh, pretty heavy on big, big fights. They weren't necessarily set pieces, just because of how much roaming you could do and, and how not confined the space was, I guess. Um, but yeah, it was pretty much just... A few big fights with a lot of monsters and gosh I really thought the first one maybe the first no it was really the second one the first one was kind of demons and archfile but but then there was like tons and tons of barons and hell knights and just a couple of archfiles and so once they were dead you're just shooting dozens and dozens of rockets for a long time and waiting for them all to die it just got kind of boring um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's an interesting concept. It, it, it kind of feels like speed mapping or something. It, it's, it's an unnecessary limitation. It's, it's, you know, it's kind of a limitation for the sake of, of a limitation. And, you know, it's, it's nice to kind of appreciate what can be done with 20 sectors. But at the same time, you, you, you just kind of look at a map like this and say, oh, I wonder what else it could have been without that limitation. So that's always kind of a something you might think about 
when maps have these kind of gimmicky limits. I mean, even when you just play a vanilla map, for, for that matter, you think about, wow, what could, what could these IWAD maps have looked like if they hadn't had to be under the viz plane limit, stuff like that, so. But, um, yeah, I mean, I don't know, nothing really to complain about. Decent map. Besides, you know, the boring Hell Knight part. <laughs>